Right. You know what I'm saying? But uh, speaking of moves. We'll talk to it. Let's talk about the ultimate move. Let's talk to it. Either Rihanna got with ASAP Rocky or ASAP Rocky got with Rihanna. It's prime time level, man. How do you think that went down? I mean, I think he probably sauteed in the, in the past type. You know what I'm saying? Because um, sauteed it good. Then she doubled back. Yeah, doubled back on like relationship mook on the public level. Um, mm-hmm. That's pro- hey, shout out to Rocky, man. That's one of the all time history greats, man. You know what I'm saying? Not only just musically, but financially, beauty and all that, man. He can't. Hey, Rihanna wanted them ones, man. I'm gonna tell y'all, it's a it's a dangerous move though because Rihanna's like a amber. She rose. like a man, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She moves like a man. Yeah, she any care. woman that moves like a man. It's dangerous. That got some clout behind her for doing what she do that everybody know that she, you know what I'm talking about? Like, nigga, that's dangerous. Right. That's dangerous because they can always like look at how Amber Rose did 21 Savage, man. That was iconic. She had them holding the sign, bro. I'm a hoe too. Damn. And this is 20 name is 21 Savage. And she was man. on no jumper saying that he wanted to do that it. He wanted to do it. Yeah. So that means that nigga signed up for it. So what you do to make him sign up for that? Ate that man Keister. You think so? Ram shot. Three of them bent over on all fours type. Yeah, I ain't gonna bend over. I tooted up. But you said you like that. You I've said that done before. I've done it before. Yeah, let it <laughs> up in there. Put the, put the nose in it. <laughs> Go ahead, baby. Go excavate. Can we elaborate on that, brother, please? Nah, man. We need that too many times. <laughs> right like, how many times we gotta go to the black hole, brother? God damn. I'm looking. You know what I, mean? I always like three pulling deep in with yeah, the goddamn yeah, yeah. with the talk with that shit. Yeah, we've been there, done that, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what it is. Shit, go ahead. Mr. Organic on all fours, get the goddamn dog eating ass. Yeah, eat it, baby. Eat me, baby. Eat me, baby. You know what I'm saying? Take care of me. You know what I'm saying? That shit I'm put that shit I'm putting putting no shit in it put together. Oh, it's tapioca pudding. Up. Nah, I ain't doing a tapioca. I prefer I prefer I prefer uh uh vanilla. Vanilla cream. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Straight up. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's the wild boy days, yeah. man. You know okay. what I mean? I done, I done calmed down a lot now, brother. Right. Okay, brother. So, you know but, what I'm but, but if it was Rihanna and you ASAP Rocky, you going? Of course. <laughs> yeah, there ain't no entries or penetrations. You going to lay on the belly and let her get it done. Oh, for sure. <laughs> and she lay on her belly behind me tight. Um, for the, where the feet dangling off the bed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> Go crazy, baby. Hey, you know what's crazy? Me and Jazz, Love and Slim, me and my fiance's YouTube channel. Go subscribe. Yeah, go uh, subscribe ASAP. First time I ever went to the red carpet. I remember she opened my eyes that. I went to the red carpet with her. Right. And we got DJ Envy sitting on my left. We got Jamie Foxx sitting in the front. We got Jill Scott to my right. right. We got, it's just crazy. Top you know what I'm saying? Uh, John Legend behind this type. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I'm just making up names at this point. There's ordinary they, people. But they're everywhere though. Right. Right? And they're all around us. And uh, Jazz got some up close and personal mooks, right? Right. And uh, Rihanna was like over to the left. And there was, you know, everybody else over there. You know, just the celebrities and stuff, right? And I remember having a moment like, yo. Little do they know, they got a nigga that's been four years in prison, ex-convict, worked his way up, miracle nigga. Right. In the midst of them. Right between them. Like it's like you know, him, savage meat, man. You remember when Snoop Dogg said, man, hey, when they was doing to save the world with Nip, and Nip was there. Nip back there he, throwing up roller 60s and all that in the background. Yeah, that bitch, he's like, hey, man, I ain't supposed to be here, cuz, but I'm here. Yeah, and he high. Right. Yeah, he with fucking joint. Elton John and goddamn uh, all of them. Brett Michaels and all that. Come on, man. Uh, the, the, the Patty LaBelle's all Oh, Big dude. Patty was there with the. Yeah, she had a, a pie in her hand, too, if Come I'm on, mistaken. <laughs> nice and warm, too, like the one off life when he oh, yeah. burnt oh, my yeah. mouth tight. Fight only pies. Come on, man. I had to eat it. So now I'm just there, and I'm like, yo, this is really crazy. But, you know, the point I'm getting to is like when we was there, you see Rihanna, right? And you got celebrities uh, fanning over Rihanna. Right. Right? And you like, yo, this is some shit. Because I'm happy just to be here. Right. Right? I'm like, whoa, I ain't even supposed to be in this motherfucker. For sure. You know what I'm saying? Like, I felt like a fucking imposter. Yeah. Right? I'm like, damn, I'm really in this You waiting for somebody to tap that shoulder. Like, hey, nigga, get yeah, out. You ain't supposed to be out here, man. Yeah, we caught you. Get, come here. Don't move. Don't be quiet, huh? Don't you do that, though. Yeah, come I ain't gonna lie to you. You're gonna be a fool. Goddamn. <laughs> don't turn it up, huh? Come on, man. You ain't about to roast me like that. You know what I'm saying? the whole goddamn Coliseum. Y'all down. about to come here and beat my ass. You know what I'm saying? This guy's just going to go out bloody. Giving out one of them victory slaps. I just thought that was kind of crazy. Like, 
what the fuck? And, and you, so I'm just like in the moment, like I'm just seeing everybody. I'm like, oh damn, that's crazy, goddamn over there. Oh, what the motherfucker over? There? Oh shit, that's crazy. Uh, motherfucker over there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. John Sally over here. Oh shit, man, we got motherfucking B J B Smooth over here, goddamn, oh, walking by and say, hey, what's up, man? You like, hey, what's up, man? Like, yeah. Hey, man. And then you gotta be surprised of the people that rock with the channel. I ain't gonna throw out no names. Yeah, cause you want to embarrass them. Come you on, gonna, man. You ain't gotta tell them Obama came up to you. Nah, hey, come on. You know what I'm saying with, Secret with, Service with, with more shit with Michelle said they they I love, love, love it slim. I mean, I, they watch. Love it slim every day. So you don't want to let me relax with the lies. Yeah, come on, man. Secret <laughs> service might be knocking at the door. Don't All go right, too nah, far. Knock, knock, knock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, no. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I remember thinking like, you know, just the whole totality of the situation, right? You're like, damn, this is really crazy. Right? For sure. And while I'm sitting there, Jazz was, wasn't with me for a good portion of time because she was out there interviewing all the celebrities that come in through the red carpet and she's interviewing them, right? right. And she's like hosting the interview. And then uh, so I'm just sitting there watching people, right? And I'm kind of just like jaded, like, whoa, all the things I just said. And then on top of that, I'm sitting there just like, damn, little do they know, right? How did I work my way up to get to this point? This right. is crazy. I went from walking on the yard to walking on the red carpet. That's this is major. It. What? And then so as I'm paying attention to everybody, I'm seeing all the fans or like all the celebrities be a fan of Rihanna. Of course. Right? There's levels to this shit. Right. right. And I'm just sitting there kind of just paying attention to all the celebrities, all of them. Right? In full totality. Right. And then as she gets up, they all praising. You had uh, what you call it there too? Um, uh, Stella got a groove back. Uh, a Angela Bassett. Angela Bassett. Yeah. All right. She's sitting in front of us. You know what I'm saying? People going crazy over her too. She's like, like in the middle of the front type. And they're going crazy. And I'm like, damn. So if this is how other celebrities are fanning over her for ASAP Rocky to be talking to her. Right. Don't get me wrong. ASAP Rocky a top level nigga. He ain't playing. I ain't been to jail. He ain't playing. Like, yeah, he slap niggas, yeah. Leave me alone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he, you know what I mean? Artistic brain type. You know what I'm for saying? sure. Oh, yeah. Big on a different genre type movement. Yeah. 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 But so it's kind of made me think like, like Chris Brown and Rihanna, that's like, you know what I mean? That's more, would you say, well, that's more for a win for him, for her, or her for him? Him for her all day. He won. Why would you say that? I mean, Rihanna top level, top levels. Not only just now he a creative dude and all that, but he ain't got Rihanna's a hundred million dollar chick, man. Minimum. So he that, the money alone and the, and the world got more than that, bro. That's what I'm saying. I'm just saying though. Yeah. Six, yeah, big. Come on, man. Nine Unlimited. figure BS, Unlimited. man. Unlimited. Yeah. So it's like and she gonna be in the billions, and you ain't even close to none of that. So mm -hmm. it ain't even in the, in the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. So to be having that speaks for itself, and we ain't gonna add to the. <laughs> Pure fame, you know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna add that. We're just gonna go off just off the money, brother. You know what I'm saying? So but is he the, came is up. the fame close? No. ASAP Rocky got like a cult following though. Yeah, but you know, man, he ain't got Rihanna's got number ones on number ones on number ones. He got a big cult following. He's like a creative type. You know what I'm saying? They rock with him, but it's 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 nothing, man. It's like a D to an A, man. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? So who would you compare ASAP Rocky to as far as another artist who's on this level? That's a dude. So um, to give a comparison as far as you know, level. Yeah, I don't know, because he ain't putting no rock type. No, he's above that. No, he's yeah, a, he, sure. he's global. You know what I'm saying? He's a global, like, on that level. But uh, International. Yeah, but he's below. He's below. So who's he below and who's he's above? Yeah, he below is like Travis Scott to them, right? So he's Travis under, Scott shit crazy. Yeah, he's glow, He's top level. So he's uh, below Travis Scott. talking to Kylie Jenner. He's below the, the I'm saying, Kendrick Lamar's and Jay Coles's and all them. You know what I'm saying? Um, he below them, you say? He, yeah, and he's in these. Like, uh, he's like right there with the Meeks type, like Meek Mill level. You know what I'm saying? He on that realm. Okay, speaking of Meek Mill, do you believe oh my God. that Meek Mill sauteed Kim K? Because uh, Kanye said they were supposedly. Yeah, meeting doing a meeting. Um, I don't know. I don't think so. Because uh, I don't know. Meek, do you man, think he had it in him to sauteed Kim K? No, I don't think so, man. Because, like, I, 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 like, I rock with Meek, but a lot of he just too sensitive. Like, he too accessible to the, to the, to the, to the trolls and just people. You know what I'm saying? Saying stuff to him and like, and then all I seen him. But you didn't went crazy on some trolls too. Yeah, but I ain't so got it's understandable. Millions, I ain't got but it's understandable, I, dog. If I was Meek Mill level, bro, I wouldn't talk to nobody, man. They would. No one would ever know how I truly thought, besides my people around me. How Hove move. No one, no one on the outside of that on a global scale would know how I truly thought about them and somebody agitate me because I want to do something. Hey, I ain't gonna know. Listen, let me tell you something. Is this the camera right here? I respectfully disagree with my brother right here. You wanna know okay, why? You can. Because this is my dog. I know. Him. Listen, I know him well. What happens with him? He'll have like a moment. He be doing good, but if when three's activated and his brain is on that, hey man. Everybody leave me alone. 
anybody can get it for sure. But I but have you give me an instance when I say names? Like he says names of people. Like I got a you you. I, uh, I'm, I don't. Oh, okay, I'm talking comments in the trolls. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, and I ain't did that. In so long you're not time. you're talking about publicly coming yeah. out saying a name and then yeah, you, know, you giving up too much intel. Like, no, you would never do that. Oh, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah, so and that's what he that. and that's what I dislike about it. Like me attacking the back. Well, who did Meek Mill say his name to? He went crazy on academics. Yeah, he went crazy on everybody. Like, academic. <laughs> like how you let him break through your site? Like come on, dog. You meet trenches. Like you letting this goofball internet dude crack your code. I tell you what he should have did though. Said nothing. I, I'm not with violence at all. Right. But you know I'm a to the mook individual. For sure. If I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. If I'm Got not going to say nothing, I'm not going to say a word. I'm going to let it be. I'm going to let it fly. Peace and love. All day. But if I'm on that other type of time, right. I ain't saying a word. Not God bless America. America. Not to nobody around me. On, my closest, like you said. Yeah. You, okay, so on that part, I... See, that's what I'm saying. Okay, but I misunderstood you because I yeah. thought you were saying, like, with the, with the comments, with right. anything. But I, I ain't comment back to no trolls and No, you've done great. Yeah. Hey, hey, brother. Hey. Yeah. Hey, I'll hey, I'll let that hey, go. Hey, you've done great with that. Appreciate brother. it, brother. You weren't told me to do that. For sure. Right. And you went astronomically with that. Appreciate you know what I'm saying? I, the growth is insane. It, yes. But I misunderstood you because I thought you were saying with in all realms. No. Okay. Yeah, we're talking about. Yeah, you would never publicly yeah, come out and say video on video with my face and I'm saying people's names. Yeah, right, like, right, right. come on, man. And he do that all the time. Like, yeah. he expose his hand all the time. So you too, you know what I'm saying? And then, like, the last thing I seen with him was just like, I don't know what went on behind the scenes and how this even took place. Right. But I know that that's something I'm not doing. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm going I'm to get out of jail with Trump, like Wayne. <laughs> but. Of, it's a clip of of uh, Meek with Mill the double, with the double bow, with double back I'm, and I'm a, double I'm gonna take that picture, brother. I'm taking that co-op, <laughs> uh, that photo op. But it's, it's I mean, he was out there in the Bahamas or something. He was out there with them billionaire homeboys, you know, them billionaire white dudes, right? And they was playing tennis. I guess he lost, and they make him do. He made them do some bunny hops on every court. Them, ha ha. They he, made Meek do bunny. Yes. It's a clip. Oh, we could pull it up, but he's bunny hopping like <laughs> jumping like this. They're counting to ten, like bunny hopping with his hands like that for the white man cooning. Now I don't know if it was like they was betting hundred thousand dollars or something against. You know what I'm saying? It could have been a sack race, bro. Like you know. No, no, he's that. on the tennis court. It was a tennis match or something like that. He lost, and they and he had to do it. Yeah, they count it, and yeah. they filming him like this. He like this. But if you yeah. lost a bet, you gotta do what you gotta nah, do. Nah, you gotta get it in blood. But yeah, come on, bro. Man, I'm not he jumping up. Somebody's gonna be recording the bed. It's supposed to be just having fun with the He knew that it was recorded. They like this with the phones in front of them doing bunny hops. I'm not doing that, man. I fuck with Meek Mill. Especially for no Caucasians. I'm not bunny hopping for no Caucasian for nothing, man. Okay, so what do you think about Meek Mill with the $20 and the kids? I'm with that. I mean, yeah, I already talked about that on my Rafe talk, man. Like, yeah. Because, like I said, you don't know what he did yesterday. And like he said, he said, I have no cash on me. That's my homeboy in the back who's a regular pedestrian gave me a dub. And I just gave it just to the Just to give kid. something, yeah. Yeah, I ain't got to give him nothing. And you don't know what I did yesterday. You don't know what I did today. You know what I'm saying? You don't know right. what's going on. But you you messed up by filming it. Why are you filming it? Right. So that was kind of strange. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to yeah, give a dub and you give it a short a, change, you should have been recorded it. That was a POV type. Yeah. So why yeah, why would you record that and upload it on your shit if you're giving out a stanky dub? Yeah. That was weird. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But me, I yeah, I, I get the part of I, I give mean, you what I give I, you. I, I, right, because this is right. how I look at it. I could have gave you fucking nothing. Right. If I never rolled down the window, you wouldn't know it was me. Yeah, don't try. And then like them little dudes are savages. They be jumping top people. level. Yeah, playing at the apes, jumping. Give me the, and say see a dope car. And you don't think they finagling? What they and they be killing niggas and all that, robbing it. Come on, man. And I and, and some and it ain't all of them. You know what I'm saying? We right. gonna salute the hustle There's little kids. Some that's just hustling. And, and doing it right. But a lot of them is acting crazy, and you don't know people interactions with what happened. You know what I'm saying? Right. And um. Yeah, you can't force me to do nothing. I don't got to do nothing, but I'm not going to record myself giving out the dirty dub, man. You know what I'm saying? If I'm going to do that, I'm giving that rack of rules and busting it down for the kids. You know what I'm saying? Right. But don't do that. You know what I mean? I, I don't like even recording doing something good for somebody because that's like, you know what I mean? That's like helping somebody clean and you give them a dirty rag and then filming it. That's disrespectful, man. Yeah, I mean, there's a time and a place for everything. Maybe that was just a bad time. Yeah, it was. That you wasn't a saying? good thing. You know what I'm saying? So over, time. like the gesture, I get it, but he I just had, feel the recording part was wrong. But he had to do a motherfucking thing. He don't never had to do nothing. But even if he recorded, nigga, I gave y'all something, nigga. I'm recording giving you something. This motherfucker's going to ride by you every day and give but you a fucking But that's another thing. thing. I tell you, you got to move smart. No way in the life you didn't think people were going to roast you for giving a dub to some kids. You know what I'm saying? You meet Milt in and in you're in a colored. You know what I'm saying? They're going to roast you. You know what I'm saying? Even though you got to do it by nothing, I salute you. Dollar goddamn uh, uh, water, I'm going to give you a 24. I get all that. But right. you're recording it, bro, and you're in a culling. 
He shouldn't have recorded it. He just, That's he just it. gave it up. That's yeah. it. That's yeah, all. Yeah, you probably right. Cause that backfired. I'm pretty sure you felt that way though. Yeah, but like he said, he didn't. He didn't, and the next day they they got him and his billionaire homeboy put a million dollars to get scholarships for kids. The next day, you know what I'm saying, went up about that. So like, what were we talking about? We talking about a dub, and this man got a million dollars getting kids scholarships. So. You know what I mean? I mean, okay. It just so, was the recording part. So let's double back then. Right. So if you brought that up, then you should also be talking about uh, when you was talking about Kyrie, you got that bum and fucking all fucked up. When you were saying right. all that shit, right? You should also be saying because he got George Floyd people a crib. I said all that, sir. You did say that the other day. Everybody, but double back with it though. No, it wasn't today. I said that. I said all the philanthropy. We talked about the philanthropy. We talk about the philanthropy. What are you talking about? I said he's right. doing all that, which is cool, okay. but do your job. So do you think that was a PR move too? No. He's really on that type of time, which I is legendary. So. I think so too. He's and it's and it's taking a toll on him, right? And and I get it, but you got to do your job, man. You know what I think is going on with Kyrie? I think uh, I think he's doing his best to please people, and he's trying to do his best to get people to love you. But then here's what the thing is: is you may be a likable person, but no matter what. One thing I found out doing this shit, bro, I got the best intention. You know me. No you know question. I'm, saying? I'm all for the people. But mm -hmm. the thing is, though, is when you find out that. Everybody ain't gonna fuck with you. Right. Everybody ain't gonna love you. Everybody ain't gonna like you. And there's gonna be people vocally, even though you're not doing weight, nothing way outside your body. For sure. They're gonna come out vocally and say how much they don't fuck with you. All day long. So when you got all the money in the world, you got everything you could ever have. Right. You, that's one thing you would never have is all the people's love. Nope. All the people's attention, all right. the people's everything. Right. So it's like, that's the one last thing you're missing. Yeah. That's the one last attribute. So you're searching for it. Yeah. And I think that kind of drove him crazy a little bit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, damn, why y'all still talking shit about me? I did this. I didn't do that. I'm taking this to toll on him. I'm taking a leap of faith. I'm trying to go out on my own. You know what I'm saying? Like different things. You know what I'm saying? I think that that kind of just, yeah, took a toll on him. Fuck with him. And, and I happens. think that also happened with Kevin Durant. I fuck with <laughs> right. Kevin Durant. You know what I'm saying? It was, it was the, it, and like I said, it was the Golden State situation. If he just would have came out and said this, listen, I can't beat him. I'm a joiner. Right. Man, why are you going to Golden State? They got a better team. I want to get me a ring. I'm going to go in there and win with them, and it's going to be easy for me. Right. What y'all going to say then? Nothing. I disagree. I think they still would be talking shit. But but what can you say? You can still talk shit. Yeah, but you just got to own it, though. Yeah, own it. Yeah. Man, you went to them. With, yeah, I did. I told y'all. It's going to be an easy win for me. I didn't want me some rings, man. I took yeah. the easy route. Because that's why they said he wasn't happy after he got those two. Right, because because he because he was trying they, to act like he just was trying to do something. Because they were still talking shit. They went way worse on him. It was seventy three win team. His own teammate Draymond get green roast just like we don't need you one without you boy nappy head peasy head nigga type called him a bitch didn't he? A bitch ass nigga we don't need you. Damn, that what he said. We did this without you boy. I ain't gonna lie, he should you know he should scrape that nigga right on the spot yeah. and he stayed on the team. But oh yeah, you got or, fucking or, you got tarantulas running around all in the goddamn locker room for your nappy ass head nigga. We didn't need that. You know what I'm saying? We didn't need you in here spreading that shit in here, man. <laughs> Spider webs everywhere from the back of your neck. You know what I mean? <laughs> you bro, kept it thorough with you. Bro, I'm starting to believe you really dislike Kevin Durant. I fuck Kevin. We born on the same day. I fucked with Kevin Durant. He was my favorite player besides Harden. That's my second favorite player. That's my second. Yeah. Mine so, is Harden than him. Mine is LeBron than him. So what I say is, is the reason why I say uh, Kevin Durant second is like because LeBron is like my favorite player to like watch and 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 see what he's doing. His behind the scenes shit is off the court. Is right. on the court. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Kevin Durant is like the nigga who was like we damn near the same height. So it's right. like when I came home from prison and I started playing basketball, that was a nigga. Like nobody could beat Kevin Durant, but Kevin Durant for sure. But that was a nigga who was like he's tall, skinny, right. wiry. You know what I'm saying? I was like, and he could shoot. I could shoot. I can't shoot like that nigga, but yeah, I can he's shoot. Come, a I'm a top. But nigga, hey, with top level handles. Right, so I was like, if I if I did my absolute hardest and went, you know what I'm saying, straight ape shit, right. maybe I could be some form of a low-budget Kevin Durant, which is a, still a top-level nigga in the regular world. For sure. You know what I'm saying? So that's why he was my second. Because he's probably, him and Akeem Olajuwon was like the two people that I probably watched the yeah, most. Akeem is ill. You it's can't train to be like LeBron. No. But Akeem had the moves of smooths. Cold. Nigga, that nigga. Wow, cold. goddamn, fuck. That cold. nigga was cold, nigga. Cold. Akeem. The dream. Kevin man. Durant. Yeah. Yeah, them niggas, them, them was, I, it, I know you don't really, KG, I rock with KG. I like KG, cool guy. I'm just talking about he's just not tough. Yeah. He's cool. Hooping-wise, he's a beast. 
Yeah. It's just pussy. Like, you ain't fighting nobody. You ain't whooping nobody, bro. Like, nobody falling for that. But basketball-wise, he was a monster. Yeah. From the sea, too. I, I like the people who I felt like, obviously, you can't beat none of them. Right. You know what I'm saying? But it was like- if Who I, you mimic your game. Who I can mimic my- Right. Who I feel like I can do a little something. You right. know what I'm saying? The like, people I loved was Allen Iverson. It was Steve Francis. Tracy McGrady. Those was my three. You know what I'm saying? That's my game. That's how I play. You know what I'm saying? Bye, bye, bye. I right, shoot. I see bye, Tracy. Bye. Yeah. Tra oh, Tra at my prime. You said, who did you say? Steve? Steve, Steve Francis. Francis. Okay, okay. Yep, Steve Francis and Allen Iverson. But at my prime, my, cl my clone of like, that's T-Mac. T-Mac. With the, with the Lando Magics. T-Mac was crazy. Whoa. Whoa. He could have. <sighs> injury took my nigga down. Damn. That back went out. He was, boy, immortal on he all a few accords. more things going on other than back, though. Yeah, he yeah. Just, it just crumbled him, man. But he was immortal on every level, especially offensive game. It was yeah. it was flawless, right? Flawless, top level, forty inch plus vert, stupid handles, unlimited right. jump shot, the most. What? And he dunking on everybody. Ooh, and the J was cool, and the handles was nasty. And that's the that's the T Mac, the hesitation pull up. That's the coldest move, one hundred percent. And that's his move. I think it was top level. Oh, what? And he like six, you. seven, six, eight, long arms. Throwing off the glass and duck, that's his move. I can dumb. He's T -Mac. Dumb, nigga. The T Mac is the uh, shot. That's his move. Kobe bro. said that was the hardest nigga he had to bring the For guard. sure. And and that's the only time in his career that when he's at his pinnacle, and this is Kobe with the fro prime. Nobody T Mac was giving it to him that one year. And he was like, damn. He never seen it. It's a play that everybody need to Google. It's T Mac versus Kobe. Um T Mac did a like a uh fadeaway, turn back, boom, boom. Kobe fell and he shut the J bang. But the yeah, crazy. I've never seen that one. Oh, look it up. It's one of the most legendary plays ever. Cause this is how you know Kobe is Kobe, and that took him above T Mac. Mm -hmm. Cause after he shook him and he fell down, hit the J, boom, looked at him on the ground. Kobe got out, got the ball, bring it up the court, right back to T Mac. Da -da. He goes baseline. He dunks on the entire team. He jumped on three. I promise you, see, he's like, okay, that's why Kobe is Kobe. The next play, he fell. He took the ball, point, brought up at the point guard, found T Mac, he guarding him. Da -da. Killer crossover, go like baseline, jumps. It's three. With the one hand, right? It was two hands oh. on everybody. Okay, Boom, and slapped the glass. Whoa. The next play. Boom, and then, I wow. said, Kobe different. He going to die out here, man. Yeah. Don't forget that man was looking like the Michelin man on his last season out, boy. Right. Packs here, packs ice here, pack here. Bop, 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 60. Bop. 60. He was fighting a rape move, man. The booty takery, man, and was hitting 60s on people. Don't ever forget it. Come on, man. Leave that man alone when it comes to that basketball, man. Yeah. Leave him alone, man. Okay, so since we're talking about basketball. Right. 